Hey guys, I came to the shop today to unbox something that I've never installed before that I'm actually doing a video on tomorrow. An install that was sent to me. So come with me just a sec. I'm going to show you what I got. This is a three-ton inverter-driven heat pump by ACIQ. I've decided to put one of these on it to help protect it. This system does not need heat strips. This is my air handler that thing is like four feet tall. And here's my condenser. It does have the reheat capability, which allows us not to need heat strips. And it comes with this simple wiring guide. And it's, it's gonna be very simple because it uses legacy wiring. 24 volt wiring like we're accustomed to and I'm going to use a two-stage thermostat on it Looking forward to it. I'm gonna unbox this one and see what it looks like color of this thing this looks nice I'm liking it already this is kind of what I was wanting to get my hands on part of the reason I opened it up my installation manual and this I'm going to read over this tonight so um I will be prepared tomorrow. All right, as you see, we're gonna have an R454 system here. This is their 17 inch wide, a little over 17 inch wide cabinet. I'm looking forward to doing this. The video may not come out tomorrow, but we are definitely installing this tomorrow. I hope this height on this thing is not gonna be a problem because it's 49 inches. Well guys, I'm looking forward to that and I will go ahead and tell you something that I have already learned about it that is unique to me anyway and is very convenient about these systems. The indoor air handler board can communicate independently with the condenser even though you're using a 24 volt thermostat, which means you can run this heat pump with two communicating wires going outside. So that means if you're replacing a straight cool system that only has two wires, you don't need to pull a new thermostat wire to run a heat pump outside, which is super convenient. I love that. And um, I plan on spending a good bit of time tomorrow on this install. So I hope to have a good video for you when it comes out. Stay tuned for it.